Welcome to a new day in Reforged Eden for Imperium Galactic Survival. You can see the sun is just coming up above the horizon. And in this part, what I want to do is come down and take a look at this House Surdu Monastery. It's a level three, which is going to make life a bit in interesting. I vaguely remember doing one of these. And if I'm correctly, it's full of bug uglies and... I think that there's a trap as well, so we're going to have to be very careful for traps. Now, for any of you following the series, uh, I'll just show you what I've done since the end of the last part is come out and explored this area here. And I found something over here. I think this might be the drone base. We found a couple of House Surdo outposts here. Lots and lots of nests and smugglers' barges. And a big thank you to Snafu, who reminded me that I missed a ammo box in one of the smugglers' barges that we found in the last part but you can see there's plenty of them now these nests don't seem to have that much in them but uh, but <clears throat> but if you need medical supplies all you can do is just hover above and kill them and i think mentioning hover above is probably if you're going to start this planet in reforged eden what you're going to have to do is once you before you leave this area here which has got quite a lot of resources in it this is the starting area this is where the heidelberg is you're certainly going to need some kind of hover ship or SV in order to ensure that you're not going to get killed because every time you put down anywhere, you seem to get surrounded by bug -ovies. In fact, I've, I think I've had some out round here as well. Let's just go and have a look. Oh, no. oh. <laughs> wait. Come back. Yeah, I mean, I've. So, Whenever you put down, you seem to get loads of the little boogers. So that's something that you need to be aware of. Now, I've got a little bit of good news with respect to the workshop. Somebody did suggest um, switching this on. And I went through and checked this. And I seem to have got back the ships that I subscribed to. Just to say, you can see I've got this SAS charger, the dropper. And and we I've also got this um, S SW Fossa. This was recommended to me as a, a small vessel. And I actually do really like the look of it. And I can't remember if I've got... We nearly got all the resources for it. We just get some small optronics bridges. So I'm kind of thinking about that. We've also got some options now. And I do like this S -S 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 SW Matic Mark II. But it's, it's going to need a lot of work for it. We haven't even got the basics for that. And I actually really like the shape of that as well. But of course, we've got um, biscuit. But it, it. But what I will say is that at the moment, what I've noticed is that it tends to the workshop. I've I've come in and looked at this when I was doing a bit of exploring the planet, and this disap It was there, and then the next time I came in, it disappeared. So I don't think it's a hundred percent stable just at the moment. For this instance, we've got everything back again. So. And that is encouraging, but at the moment I can't make up my mind what ship I would like to actually use. I certainly wouldn't mind one of these in the long term as my, um, say, my attack CV, which when when the Janus becomes the orbital carrier, uh, I think we've now got the Scorpion, but the trouble with the Scorpion is we need three small upgrade kits. I, I'm pretty sure I don't have, I, I think we've only got one small upgrade kit. Anyway, let's just get into the SV, turn the shields on, turn the thrusters off. And I've kind of got kitted up and ready to go. Because, of course, this is Reforged Eden. So if you're going to go anywhere, you've got to um, absolutely fully kit it up. The other thing I've also done is I come to on this side. Oh yeah, I've decided the well, let's do it on this side. Come into the cargo of the thought I'd give this X Corp LR forty seven Thunderbolt a go. But what to do, but to be able to power it we need these dual cells, but I've absolutely no idea what oh I've just picked that up, haven't I? <laughs> Other thing I've also brought with me is we've got some ablative spray against dermal and radiation burns. I think that gives us some protection against uh, flamethrowers as well. We've also got an insect repellent. These are two medications. I think this one gives us, if we get into lots and lots of bug uglies, 
that will give us a bit of protection. I've also brought, brought some purified water with me and gates for flamethrowers as well, so when we get blasted. So, um, let's see if I can show you the bugger, please. No. Nope. Had swarms of them hanging around uh, when I was out. Anyway, let's just get down to business. So there's the pseudo monastery. Kind of nearly loaded, got plenty of ammunition. And we'll just go up here. Now I have done a bit of a fly past. Just to see how things are. But there's two turrets, there's one on the top. I think there might be a bit of a blind spot. If we get in really quick. Yeah, ha ha ha. What we're going to need to do is. It's going to. Oops, down, 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 down. Oh, that was close. I think we've woken up the entire Bug Ugly Brigade. Just let the shields rebuild back up again. <laughs> Two of them are firing, aren't they? Oh, right, we got rid of this guy. Damn. Tight. Getting tight. Let the shields build back up again. We'll go back to first person, I think. Sometimes. Let's have a look round now. See if there's anything else. Um, absolutely no idea which, where the way in is. Is there any the car? You land on the roof or anything like that? No. Ah, so this looks like the entrance. Uh -huh. I'll put the ship down. That doesn't sound good. There's some over an overseer. Okay, we're gonna have to use a little bit of extreme prejudice here. Uh -huh. There was a. Oh, I'm gonna blow the door open. But, don't worry. And there's a. If we can clear out the spawners. Oops. I don't think I've still got, I've got I don't think I've got the spawner yet. <laughs> Just gonna keep the ship far enough away so the turrets can work. Turn the thrusters off. Okay. Mm. We can... What I've done is I've actually got a combat shotgun now. Um, if we can get in here. I suppose they're going to know that I'm round here, I suppose, which is... Right, so the spawner just right in front of the the turret. I want to get rid of that spawner. We're going to do it. Actually, um, yeah, we'll, we'll do it with it with thrusters. It's Okay. 
circle back a bit. This <laughs> is off. Whoa. Take a look, see. Well, something tells me this. What on earth have I been? You're bleeding. Is it a health pick? Yes. That was a flamethrower guy, I think. And just stand here and see what we got inside. Oh, there's a turret there. Um Right, we're going to need to get rid of the turret. Oh. Ah. Right, there's some side doors. <laughs> Some damage. Wow. Okay. Med kit. Med station. That's going. Let's put eat some of that. Put that in the fridge. Some oxygen bottles. Radiation stuff. Shove this in the cargo. Um, back to the fridge. Although while I'm keeping this stuff, I've got this one, but. Make sure that. Right, we need to get rid of that turret. <laughs> this right, I'm going to run out of ammunition. Just getting through the front door. Right, there's a corner there. We can get that. Where did you come from? That gets rid of that one. <laughs> yeah, you nearly got me with the flamethrower. Right, we've got to get rid of that turret, but... Right. I can get up on this side. He's right behind that door. Ah. Well, <laughs> sorry guys, I've got to calm down, count to ten, a bit of zen phobia. Wow, I think I, I was. Very lucky there. It's a trapdoor there. You... And it's just in the right place, the position that someone would move into to, to take out that turret. That is evil. How am I going to get through this front door? That bandage. Got to find. Got to get rid of that turret. First things first. Um, right, we got that there. Got the frag grenade.
Right, let's, let's give it a go. If I, if I can get underneath, let's use the old underneath technique. Get with him. We've got to be a little bit careful. Right, he's gone. Right, so we got rid of the turret. Let's just do some reconnaissance. <laughs> well, one thing with this with this POI, I've got to kill 29 troopers, um, Xerox troopers at the moment. Right, so right, we got that one a bit weird. We got some loot stuff there. We got turret at the end there, going that way. And what have we got going? I think there's like some invisible spawner here and we've got something in there okay reload Guy's not messing about, is he? <laughs> Thank goodness I've got mounted turrets. Otherwise, this would be very difficult. Right, that door's closed. This, can we get in here and get rid of that? of the turret Wait, dipstick I'm not getting anything else spawning here kind of <laughs> when we Belongs to another faction. I certainly don't want to open that door. Well, just... I know I shouldn't be doing this, but right, so we got some kind of control on this side, and we've got some kind of control in here. So something tells me we've got to go through that door there. Won't you? Right, let's just go back and have a little bit of an unload. I need to heal up anyway. Huh. So we'll just duck in here. Load the bridge. And still okay, I think, with respect. I don't think we need the what we call it stuff uh, the how long does this last for thermal protection right we're going to use one of these hmm. where did you come from Flamethrower time. Well, of course, it's level three here, so um, I need to get rid of that up spawner. Got rid of it. Now. shells <laughs> pistol rounds got my submachine gun 
Right, I think we've now got... <laughs> um, to reload. Right, I think that belongs to another faction. Right, I think we're going to do some recon first. I don't really want to sit in here. So, let me just get back over here. Let's just stay outside the... I think that ablative, ablative uh, shielding helped. Uh, because I, I don't think... So, I must admit, it's probably only... The, so, we got this underground room here. Not corner there we've got kind of a room through here like this this is the room I dropped down into and we've got okay we've got bad news room in there <laughs> let's just make sure let's just reload that No, I'm wasting ammunition, but something tells me that this is going to get a little bit Oh, go away Um I think we're kind of um, oh, a bit of a shadow on my left hand side there. Frightened living daylights out of me. Nobody hiding behind me. out retreat back to the safety of uh, the ship cover <laughs> just load him and whoops don't need that um, put this in the fridge um, don't need that like this um Rid of the Got that room there. We know that room's there. Right. Frag ah. I think we're going to welcome these guys with some frag grenades. I think. Sorry I'm not staying very much guys, but this is very, very intense. Mm. 
just in case. Here, um, Merlin, Argo, not, there's still more going on down here because I can't get the view. It's almost like hmm. oh there's the core I was about to say it's almost like the core hiding from me but well oh there's a good connection well uh, certainly take that Everything has gone a little bit misty. I'm actually, um, I'm actually pushing back in my chair at the moment. <laughs> oh, I didn't get that spawn. Okay. Right. Um, is it going to be worth coring this? I can still hear creatures going around. I mean, I'm not sure if it's got any fuel in it or anything like that. Not seeing anything here. Um, let's just come around here. Let's see what's behind the. Seven hundred and seven hundred and sixteen fuel generator there. No. It's this alien thin block there. Um, this is where. Okay. That's all. Oh, that's that's a quick way into that the core. Okay, guys. So if you ever do this again, rather than fight your way all down through here, you can come in here, take out the thin the thin block here. And then the core would just be smack on just there. Um, just take some of this stuff so that we can see. Uh, we got some loot boxes. Just get rid of that chair. So we got that there. Um, a little bit of glass. Epic there. Just take these out. Not quite. <laughs> um, that go into there, and the rest can go to the bridge. Go box for that. We can. Oh, it's double stacked. I hate it when it does that because it means that you can't get to the. Yes, we can. That's good. Quite often, what's going to happen is you can't actually get to the out the way. Right, we got these. Um, I'll certainly take that. Um, the radium thorn. Uh, I can still hear bug uglies around, so there must be something in here that still. Worth uh, looking at. Um, doo -doo -doo. It's probably that other room that was sealed. We were just. Here 
we got a reasonable amount of loot here. EVA boost. <coughs> right, let's just go back here and I think what I might do is beat the peas. Play that. That was the game. I think what we'll do is we'll trade out the rocket launcher. We got See what this thing's like. Right, let's see what's That's an unpleasant surprise, wasn't it? Um, I don't think I like this thing. Uh, it's not my type of weapon, to be honest, and it's relatively expensive. I, I don't get a feel for it. I mean, maybe if I get a chance, but it's. I don't know. I just didn't seem to give me a feel that I was actually shooting at something. But it was a bit unpleasant having to come round to here. Um, that's the other side of the room. Okay. So you've got two ways in. You can come down this side. Wait. Which could be probably the easier of the two ways once you got past the turret, and then you got that there. Um, got some fuel here. Um, five, three. Fuel. And fuel tank. It's getting dark, so we'll put the light on. Um, got the light. take that out. Three, four. Okay. Ha. Uh, I'd switch to that. Same work. Take that. Which I'll go. And we got that. And I would say that that is probably about it for this POI. Um, cut. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> um, really missed that, didn't I? Switch up here. How on earth would you? Get up there. Um, I suppose you could get back up back. And I presume that if you pulled that switch there, that would blow up the core. So that's another option, isn't it? Um, Yeah, then he missed them. Let's have a look at the other side. Turret there. What's this here? That's the... Wow, so there's all sorts of ways you could get do this, POI. Um, there's a... I've got myself lost. And I definitely think that's about it now.
So if you could get to the door, oh, blow open those things there. If you had a powerful enough jetpack, you could jump up into here and from this ramp. And then probably flip that switch will destroy the core. Hmm, interesting. Maybe if I we find another one of these, we'll, we'll give that a go and see how far that works. Right, guys, I think this is where I'm going to leave it because I think that is a self-contained unit and quite an interesting unit. In fact, my, my finger actually hurts where I've been gripping the mouse so much. But until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.